supporters of the candidate of the Action Alliance for the Kogi State Governorship election gather at the Omala Town Hall to receive new members. <laughs> The AA candidate is joined by the leader of the defectors from Omala local government area, Mr. Emmanuel Solomon, who was the People's Democratic Party candidate for Omala State constituency in the last general election. You will be shocked what will come up. We are tired of the poverty. Yes. We are tired of all promises that are not being fulfilled. We are tired of it. This young man has a long way to go. So I don't see any reasons why he will feel and disappoint today. Some other time he will come up for another thing. Therefore, by the grace of God, November 11, 11, we shall be there. Poverty has ravaged our state for too long. 27 years, over two decades of poverty. Increased poverty in our communities. And what we're saying is this. It's a matter of urgency for us to focus on wealth creation today. But you cannot create wealth if you don't empower the people. Yes. Our people need to start making money for government to make money. The leadership of the party is confident of victory following their engagements across the state. The, the campaign of this guy Oibo today from PDP to AE has seriously galvanized the people hard to do what? To seriously now go into AE. Uh, in those days, the, the AA is just like a relaxing of a team, not until Brian Monau came. Seriously, and one thing with Tomala, I know quite sure is that when they say they will do something, they will do it. When they say they will vote for AA or Lainka, they will do that. We have a lot of Yorubas in Omala here and other tribes that are warming up to vote for AA. So he's, 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 he's on, on the track. I'm elated. I'm happy because a lot of young people, they are seeing that there's a future with our start agenda for wealth creation. You can see there's several, several graduates in our state that are in every community and jobless. The campaign train then hits the streets of Omala town, urging the people to come out on Saturday, November 11, to vote for the candidate of the Action Alliance.